Hey guys, I am Tushboy, and today we are watching The 100. Um, I said this in my hour action, but I'll, I'll say it again just for a bit of clarity. If you follow my Twitter, you'll know I lost my granddad yesterday, so I'm having a bit of a shit time, but my granddad was a very big believer in what I do, and he was a big dreamer, and... And, um... He always believed that whatever I put my mind to, I could do, and that I should never give up. So, in the spirit of that, we are continuing with reactions. They may not be as good as usual, which is saying something, because they're not usually good anyway. Um, but... This episode is called DNR. Which means, do not resuscitate. Let's go. Oh. Raven, baby. Raven, you need to know. No, don't not get in that. Raven. Holy shit! You can tell me that it's none of my business, but why live in a hole in the ground when you have a perfectly good rocket? No, Raven. Raven, you are not doing this. Raven, listen to me, Batgirl. You are not to oh, okay, see. Okay, so. Shit. Isn't it right, Mr. Green? Most beautiful thing I've ever seen. It won't be easy. Aww. There will be plenty of hard work to go around. But together, we have struggled. And together, we will rise. Yeah! yeah. Pack your Finally! I like Jaha again. Okay. We leave at first light. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're sure, Go bang. Go bang. The boys are grown up. So what? We hole up in a bunker now? Oh, God, right. Says, oh, no, you stay outside. You stay outside and you, you sit in the prime fire. Since when do we listen to what Jaha says? Yeah, exactly. Let him die. Quick. What is this? There doesn't have to be any fire. Oh, damn. Oh, Ice Nation. That was always going to happen. Welcome nah. To the Where the fuck have you been? Well, you didn't actually think that was going to end well for you guys. The Ice Nation is so much bigger. How do you know? I just found out. Aww. Thanks for trying to warn me. <laughs> you still have to turn I... into a war. It's already a war. Only if you fight it. Your people betrayed me. Look. Yeah, that was a pretty do? shit move. Live? If anyone can convince mortal enemies to move in together. Ha! <laughs> it's you. It's you. Oh my god, that look! Oh! So I'm calling for the summit. I love this show. I don't know. I, I just, I, I really do love this show so much. I was, um, I was thinking about Lewis, about how you blame yourself for his death, because you didn't stop to save him from the Black Rain. You didn't do that because you're a coward, Harper. You did that because you wanted to live. It's called True. survival instinct. This is the first time I ever thought you were a coward. Oh, damn. Get up, Harper. <laughs> Get up and fight. Like my granddad used to say, never give up. No matter how hard it gets, never give up. Aren't you going the wrong way? I'm talking about your brain. Damn. You need to ask yourself, how are you going to go out? No, here? Raven is not going to die. Not Miserable, in pain, or out there, free, floating. And I've run all the simulations. There's not enough fuel to get back. You said anything about getting back. Your friends are taken care of. They don't need you to keep them alive in the Yes, bunker. they fucking do. But you will need them. If you go there. 
Oh, Indra. All my enemies in one place. Who are they? Oh, and the war chiefs of the Tree Crew Alliance. Oh. She was supposed to be alone. More fun with that being. <laughs> you murdered our people. You burned our villages. Yet you have the nerve to come here in the name of peace. Not peace, survival. You tried to take this bunker for yourself. Yet here I am. Willing to talk. The Tree Crew Alliance holds the temple. Of course you're willing to talk. <laughs> That's very true. <laughs> None of your people will get inside unless we come to terms. This war is inevitable. The only reason it hasn't happened before now is that Lexa commanded it. The only thing that's inevitable is prime fire. In six days, anyone who is not in I'm this bunker will be dead. I'm about to hit Australia and climb out on the beach and on the barbie. Rowan. you in Polis. You murdered my friend Taro. Cut off his head. I'm not that person anymore. No. Please. You don't want to do this. Trust me. Just walk away. Take him out. Oh. <laughs> You really shouldn't have done that. Like I said, really shouldn't have done that. Anyway, I have to get some milk. This is who I am. I just like to point out that she killed all three of those with a gardening tool. A gardening tool. <laughs> this chick is OP as shit, I love it. Everyone left, what are you doing? Change your mind? No. I'm here in case you guys change yours. Always the optimist. Go. Survive. That's what cockroaches do, right? <laughs> and ravens fly. Can we please get back to work? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Sorry. Just like that. Yep. Without guns, without anyone trained in ground or combat, there's no way we can win. Hey, we fight. We die. I do love Octavia. Bad that girl's badass. Um, well, thank you very much for watching, guys. You know what? The Hundred is such an incredible show, and I just I, don't, I really want to focus on Raven and Octavia, my two favorite characters. So you can imagine if if Raven dies, I'm I'm going to be up shit creek without a paddle. Um, but that was 
that was beautifully done because I love how Raven's mind works and I love how we're getting so much closure with her and Murphy, especially because he was the one who shot her at the end of season one uh, and, and messed up her ability to walk. Um, so it's very interesting to see all these characters come back together and merge and, and, and really put to bed things. Now, I really love the fact that Octavia is going to be fighting in this, but I have a feeling um, Rowan is going to choose Echo to fight and we're going to get a rematch. Um, and I wonder if Octavia will win this time, you never know. Um, but she, last time she fought a cliff that was kind of impossible to survive. But um, she, the girl did it. She must have hit like an air pocket as she hit the water or something. It must, she got real lucky. She got real lucky, let's put it that way. Um, most people will be dead from the injuries Octavia's. Games, but apparently Octavia just gets stronger. So I'm very intrigued to see how Octavia continues to develop this season. I like it that she's she's starting to meld both her personalities together, the, the, the calm farm hand lady and the 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 assassin killer. And I and I love I love how they're merging together. And if you think back to Octavia of season one compared to this girl, they're totally two different characters. Octavia of season one was like, oh, all happy and rainbows and she'd never seen the earth before and she was so Glad about everything, and Octavia of Season 4 just kills everyone, so <laughs> it's kind of like a bit of a difference. But it's an incredible, incredible um, arc, and Marie plays it so well, she really is Marie. And um, I'm just, I'm so impressed. Now Raven, Lindsay, oh god, Lindsay kills me every time, Lindsay Morgan. She just absolutely kills me because she has such a range, and Raven's definitely the de best developed character of the entire show. I don't care what you say, it's true. Um, for me, anyway. Um, and she just she just really gives off this this air of total she's gone from a rebellious teenager to this in control woman of her own destiny. She knows what she wants, even if that means to die. She knows what she wants. Um and I'm terrified that Raven's gonna die, but if she does, you know, it'll be a fucking badass death. You can guarantee that. You can guarantee and I'll cry. Um Monty, I'm I'm intrigued by Monty stopped, but I think Monty stopped so that he can change Harper's mind and hopefully drug just <laughs> I don't want Jasper to live, but I feel like he's gonna. Uh, <laughs> all the ones we don't want to live seem to survive, um, except Pike. That was satisfying as fuck. Um, but no, what I mean is that um, with him coming, with with Monty staying, Harper's gonna be feeling guilt about killing Monty, Monty, and so hopefully she'll pull herself together, get in the jeep, and they'll drive off into the sunset, which is actually a radiation ball heading straight towards them. But they'll survive. They'll get into the bunker. Will Octavia win? I don't know, um, but I feel like Rowan may let Clark's. In. Anyway, I feel like Echo might beat Octavia again, and Rowan lets Clark screw in and stops Echoes from killing Octavia. It'll be an interesting development fight anyway, so I'm very excited. Thank you very much for watching, I will see you in the next video, I hope you have a great day, and I do love you all. This has been DNR, I have been Joshua Boy, and you've been awesome. Goodbye.